Hello guys, this is Adam and here I have the M5 MacBook Pro 14 uh, inch with the M5 uh, 16 gigabyte of RAM and here I do have Lenovo Log 15 with the RTX uh, T50 6 gigabyte version, not the 4 gigabyte version so this is going to be against that with a blender to have GPU compute supported and we're gonna go ahead and render now keep in mind the first render is the kernel render so we will not count that and here I I do have NVIDIA GeForce uh, RTX 3056 gigabyte laptop GPU did and then GPU compute and I'm gonna go ahead and render now keep in mind both devices are connected to power the kernel run here took 17 seconds and 71 so we're gonna go ahead and do a second run so we can see what type of results that we will be getting so this actually took 30 seconds so here we have 17 seconds and here 30 seconds now keep in mind the 30 seconds here is because this is the first run the kernel run and then we're gonna go ahead and do the second run so we'll see so here with the second run we got 17 seconds this was done in 27 seconds so basically the 3050 is as powerful as the m1 max uh, macbook pro 32 core because it takes roughly around the same time however we're gonna do a run one more time and then we will see the difference between those two machines so as you can see right here we have a 27 seconds and here we have 17 seconds so the difference between the two is 10 seconds where the M5 is faster than a 3056 gigabyte version but before doing the splash I would like to do one more run or two runs here because I did set this to be in a performance mode so I want to see if this is in a performance mode is this gonna change and is the performance is gonna be better or is it going to be the same where we are still getting 27 seconds we still got 27 seconds as well I'm gonna go ahead and run it again one more time just to see if that would make any difference okay so it was done again and that was a 26.9 so basically 27 seconds so this the maximum that it can do is a 27 seconds and definitely the fans are kicking in for the performance mode but that's not making any difference for us and yes I do have it on system optics and only choosing the NVIDIA GeForce RTX 3056 gigabyte version as you can see right here so I did start this Fox splash project using EV and here we got 11 seconds seconds as you can see right here and that is for the m5 macbook uh, pro and this took 18 seconds so the difference between the two is six seconds and this is definitely a performance that is very similar to the m1 max macbook pro 32 core and that's where the ballpark of the performance is however this is definitely much faster i'm gonna run it one more time so the m5 is done and this time the m5 only took eight seconds that's very interesting i mean it might be a fluke it might be just because i have built it so many times that it gave me an eight second time but that time is insane and for the windows machine the lenovo machine it only took 17.9 seconds so it's still in the margin of error for 18 seconds that's where the performance is at with the 3050 6 gigabyte version now before i close this here is one thing that you need to know about the 3050 6 gigabyte version it's actually the same exact die for the 4050 RTX 6GB version. They are exactly the same thing, just the naming is a little bit different. So this is actually a representation of the performance for the 4050 as well, just so you would know. So in this case, the M5 is better than the 3050 and the 4050. However, I do not know about the 5050 just yet because I do not have access to that in the meantime. However, there is a video of this going against a 5060 desktop version be sure to check the comparison against a 5060 desktop version.